Welcome back everyone, Kostin here on Serious Gaming, continuing my let's play of Battlestar Galactica Deadlock. Alright, so Lestra. Mission 5, send him from Crisis. Transfer to BSG 75. Okay, jump. And let's go with this mission. The fifth mission out of 10. So there's 10 missions in total. Let's proceed. And after this one, I'll start pumping out battle stars for the Iron Legion. All right, here we are. Okay, let's get going. Fleet group is jumping in three, two, one. Jump complete. Cylons present in the operational zone. Marine Raptors are clear for launch. Coddle is attached to Fireteam Alpha. Check your radio for me again, Larson. Those hazmats can get in the way. Wilco, Galactica. Fire teams Alpha and Ophion are standing by and ready. Dr. Cottle even managed to get his suit right on the third try. Gods, doesn't it scare you running into danger all the time? Every day, Ares tests me. The day he finds me wanting, he will guide the bullet that takes me. Once you accept that death is inevitable, there's little left to fear. Uh, that's why it scares me. Take me by surprise. Make my heart stop when I'm not watching, all right? Knowing that it's coming and running toward it? Ugh, nope. Not doing that. Anyway, uh, radio checks. You're clear to fly. Good hunting, Marine. Okay. Uh, let's deploy everything. Yes, sir. Launch all squadrons. Now... I want to keep my distance I'm here on it, in Commander. this one. There's a nebula cloud over there, and that's going to significantly hamper me if enemy ships start going inside that cloud. Yes, Maybe sir. I want to go I'm in that it, cloud Commander. actually myself, take out this group of five ships. Then we have four ships in behind over there. Either way. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So say we all. Launching drones. Friendly squad. 
squadron is dark. Hostile unit identified. Alpha and Ophion have breached interior. No visual untangles yet. Corporal Ditko has point. I don't like what I'm seeing, actual. There's human bodies strapped to beds in here. They're contorted like they've suffered nerve damage. They're... There's no respect for the dead here. Yes, sir. Radiological alarm. about swept the station. Fireteam Opion is breaching the live hazard environment. Frack! Django's 12, Ditko's hit. Take him down! Take him down! So, Centurions. Okay, uh, let's see. We got missiles incoming there, and they still haven't taken that out. Damn it all. Well, the Vipers are uh, still fighting against the... Uh... Yes, Commander. Okay. Fire missiles. That one's gone. All hostiles are neutralized. What's Ditko's status? He's still alive. Looks worse than it is. Here, help me get him up. Leave him there, Lieutenant. Ares, Lord of Crisis. Receive this penitence on behalf of sins committed, past and future. The frack are you doing? This man isn't dying. Lead us toward penance and deliver us from evil. So say we all. His suit has been compromised. Look around, Doctor. The people on those beds did not die peacefully. Either Ditko's passage to Elysium is torment, like theirs, or we usher him quick and painlessly. Wreck me. All right. Let's see what we can target. Gorgon. Get it. Yes, Commander. I'm on it, Commander. Status Alpha? Are you also getting that weird ringing sound down there, or is that just me? I hear nothing. Coddle is downloading the data. We'll be back in the air in five. Until then, if you would stop cluttering our lines, sir. Give him a break, Sergeant. This is probably the kid's first mission that's gone sideways. Hey, I'm not some nugget scrub fresh off the base. I served during the Lebron in- Frack it, this is taking too long. Marines, grab that whole hard drive and leg it. Anything left behind is getting torched with whatever they were cooking up in here. You heard the man. Wait for our people to clear and then light the whole station up. Prepare Hangar Bay 4 for full quarantine scrub.
Make sure they incinerate the suits. All right, then. We need to get our guys. Well, so far, so good. Minimal damage to ships. Armor has been... Uh, has been reduced, though, but... Outside of that... What's really annoying is the nebula itself, actually, because, like, with... With yes, that Commander. situation being what it is. I need to get my ships over. With that situation being what it is. Boost yes, sir. thrusters. Alright, get closer. Crap. Yeah, that's bad. Black reload now. Missiles incoming. Yes, Commander. All right, Cerberus. Take it out. Gorgon out. Cerberus out soon, hopefully. Minotaur is taking damage. Okay. Yes, sir. Get out of there. Take that one out. Yes, sir. Very well. Another Hostile Argos. Oh, that's a mine. Right? Yeah. But they do have a nuke. Got it. Yes, sir. All right, Minotaur is still taking damage. Take, Got it. Deal with that Revenant. Minotaur is taking damage. Yes, Commander. Taking damage. Yes, sir. Is taking damage. All marks are dark. Coddle and the Marines will be done with quarantine in an hour or so. Then Intel can find out what the toasters were doing on that hellhole.
that nebula there certainly helped the Cylons avoid a lot of pain. Also the fact that they had the elevation advantage for much of the battle, so they switched to a lower elevation, which helped them greatly. I need flak reload now. Three enemy ships destroyed, very good, Jupiter class and the Galactica and Fea have both been upgraded. Uh, the Minotaur, yeah. alright. The Amunet, okay. Right. Anyway. All right, very good. Victory. All right, folks, tell me what I'm looking at. Mr. Singh looks like he's about to burst. The main thing is we can confirm that Lachesis is making biological weapons to target our civilian populations. Everything else is secondary. Everything else? Yeah, there was a lot of other data on that hard drive. For instance, the frequency that was... The fracking frequency. The frequency that was ringing in our ears. I came across a recording of it attached to an incomplete set of coordinates. Good find, Lieutenant. Are the coordinates complete enough to establish a recon zone? In a couple of days, with intel, sure. You've got six hours. Without another lead, all we've got is Cylons eager for unrequited chemical destruction. If we expect another attack like Aralon, then we're going to be ahead of it this time. You have something else, Sergeant? Sir, 
Permission to rotate CIC patrol so I can administer to Corporal Ditko's vigil. Of course. But take your rack time first. I need you on your feet as first sergeant, more than I need you asleep as a chaplain. The gods lift those who lift each other, sir. Some days it feels like Ministry wants us to be the golden poster boy for their recruitment drives. Other days like we're their janitors, cleaning up everyone else's mess. Ministry has decided it's time for this colony ship to join the big leagues. Unfortunately, the Cylons don't agree, and they've ambushed the ship on its way to reassignment. We need to intercept and protect Colonial Fleet's newest asset. Sure, I mean, it's only a, one of the most powerful Cylon fleets that they have. What could possibly go wrong? Anyway, I'm going to build a Mark II. This is prohibitively expensive though. So I'm just going to save before making that decision. So save here, okay, done. And let's build a Mark II, uh, Jupiter Mark II. And that's without rushing it. Right, uh, repair. Oh, well, that's gonna be nasty, isn't it? Okay. <laughs> yeah. Between repairs and building a Mark II, not enough uh, resources, unfortunately. Lovely. Anyway, so I will need to reload and just focus on fully repair and then uh, worry about close. Jump. Well, I could always end the turn and yeah. Just so I can reduce the jump costs a bit. Some days it feels like Ministry wants us to be the golden poster boy for their recruitment drives. Ministry has decided it's time for this colony ship to join the big leagues. Unfortunately, the Cylons don't agree, and they've ambushed the ship on its way to reassignment. We yeah. need to intercept and protect Colonial Fleet's newest asset. All right, proceed. This one's gonna be a nightmare, isn't it? 11,000 means we are dealing with base stars. 11,000 means we're dealing with two, three, even more base stars. And that's just the big ones, uh, let alone Argus, uh, Argus's, Cerberus's, all that kind of stuff. So that's gonna, this is gonna be a nasty one. A really damn nasty one. All right. <laughs> yeah, you can already figure that out, how bad this is going to be. Okay. So let's try and Minotaur over there behind the field, behind the protection of the flat guns of the Jupiters. Let's get going. Prepare to jump in three, two, one. Greatest contacts, one friendly, multiple hostiles. Hmm, one friendly. Let's see about that friendly. Yes, sir. You are gonna get the hell out of here. Okay. Launching fighters. So we have a ranger. A lot of effort to save one ranger. So say we all. Anyway. Deploy all vipers and raptors and launch our attack. Confirmed squadron target. Okay, send them in. Okay, we're gonna have to deal with the enemy squadrons first and foremost. Commander. 
All weapon, all ships boost. Uh... Got it. Okay. Activate flex. Very good. Squadron is taking fire. IFFs have come back hostile. Got it. All right. Target that arachne. Friendly squadron is dark. Holy crap. Yeah, that's uh that's really not good. All right. Target Target it again and Keep getting lower. Got it. Got it. All right, base stars firing everything they've got. Holy crap, is that a lot? Missiles incoming. Friendly squadron is dark. I'm on it, Commander. I'm on it, Commander. Yes, sir. Launching drones. Jupiter is taking damage. Minotaur is taking damage.
I'm on it, Commander. Yes, sir. Yes, Commander. Battlestar is taking damage. Well, that was fun. Not really. Okay, just gonna need to keep my distance, fight them from a range, really. That was an utter fucking nightmare. Right, proceed. Get the ship from Dry Dock, they said. It would be easy, they said. Well, I'm going to switch to Assault Raptors on every single uh, ship. Okay. Uh, that's a bit different. Right, anyway, assault raptors. Let's get to it. Fleet group is jumping in three, two, one. Dratus contacts, one friendly. Yes, Commander. Yes, Commander. I'm on it, Commander. Launching fighters. Yes, sir. Got it. Got it. I'm on it, Commander. Yes, Commander. Yes, sir. Missile tubes prepped.
so say we all. Got it. Centurions have boarded one of our ships. Centurions have boarded one of our ships. Jupiter is taking damage. Launching drones. On it, Commander. Jupiter is taking damage. So say we all. I'm on it, Commander. Jupiter is taking damage. They can't get back up. Yeah, this mission is really ridiculous. Battle Star is taking damage. That's that. Galactica is dead. What can I say? Free base stars. Uh, yeah, free base stars and so much ridiculousness attached to them. Let's try again. 11,000 points, that's just fucking mad. Okay. Begin. Fleet group is jumping in three, two, one. Try again. Dreadus contacts. Yes, sir. Yes, Commander. And deploy all Launching squadrons. Fighters. Begin firing. Yes, 
Yes, sir. Confirmed squadron target. Squadron target. The hell? What the, f what the fuck? Launching drones. How did it take so much damage there? Yes, Commander. Yes, Commander. Confirmed squadron target. So one base star got eliminated. We still have two and we still have the Argus to deal with in the Cerberus. Friendly squadron is dark. Missiles incoming. Alright, deal with that Cerberus.
Missiles incoming. Jupiter is taking damage. Got it. Yes, sir. Supply Raptors are ready. Missiles incoming. Battlestar is taking damage. I'm on it, Commander. So say we all. So say we all. Jupiter is taking damage. Son of a bloody fuck. Really? Well, I'm going, going to deploy farther away and I'm just gonna have to hope the ranger is going to be able to reach me in time. That's all I can do, really. Because I clearly can't win a knife fight, not with so many damn torpedoes and from so many angles as well, that's that's kind of the issue. I mean, I guess I could stack the battle stars one uh, on top of each other, probably should do that actually. Different heights and all that kind of stuff. To form a real flak wall that can cover, that can give me a very solid protection all around. Because as things stand right here, yeah, you know what, I'll just try that. This isn't the worst thing I've done, honestly. Switch to assault raptors. Regular raptors just aren't good enough. Okay. Fleet group is jumping in three, two, one. Dreadus contacts, one friendly, multiple hostiles. This seems a bit overkill though, even for the Cylons, all things considered. Yes, Commander. Got it. Begin firing. I'm on it, Commander. Okay. That should provide me the coverage that I absolutely need. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It was also unfortunate the Galactica apparently rammed the Minotaur at the at the start of that uh, previous mission. Tubes prepped.
Yes, Commander. Salvo launch ready. Missiles incoming. Friendly squadron is dark. Minotaur is taking damage. Centurions have boarded one of our ships. Launching drones. So my wall of b uh, battle stars actually works. <laughs> Interesting. I was skeptical of it, let's just say. Alright, so we got uh, an Argus and... Uh, and a base star. Alright, the boarding party is pretty strong there. Gonna need to withdraw these guys to deal with the war Confirmed driver. squadron target. Missiles incoming. Styles are down. Let's bring in the new recruit. Hope that was worth it, really. As in, it's not even about the ship, it's uh, really about uh, uh, getting the resources and lowering the Cylon threat level. 
that's the reason you should do these kind of missions. Ministry has decided it's time for this colony ship to join the big leagues. Unfortunately, the Cylon... Some days it feels like Ministry wants us to be the golden poster boy for their recruitment drives. Other days, like we're their janitors, cleaning up everyone else's mess. Well, I need to lower the fret level before the next, uh, th before the next mission. All right, BSG 75. Iron Legion, let me see the officer there. Promote. Actually, how much would the. Let's see. Blueprints. No, it's not telling me. Yeah, so we have a lot of things. Cluster bombs. Yeah, I don't know how much requisition I need. Though I imagine that might uh, unlock automatically, but still. Plays to... Uh, pays out to play it safe, really. Anyway, Costine here, signing off. Thank you all for watching and stay tuned for more.